Marcel Morse. 41 languages. Marcel Morse. Born the 10th of May, 1872. Epinal, Vosges, France. Died the 10th of February, 1950, aged 77. Paris, France. Alma Mater École Pratique des Hautes. Etudes. Known for the gift. Scientific career. Field Sociology Times Anthropology. Institutions École des Hautes Etudes en. Sciences Socials, AHIS. Signature. This article needs additional citations for verification. Please help improve this article by adding citations to reliable sources. Unsourced material may be challenged and removed. Find sources, Marcel Morse News Times Newspapers Times Books Times Scholar Times Gesta, January 2016. Learn how and when to remove this message. Marcel Morse, French, Mose, the 10th of May, 1872 10. February, 1950, was a French sociologist and anthropologist known as the father of French ethnology. 1. The nephew of Emile Durkheim, Morse. In his academic work, crossed the boundaries between sociology and anthropology. Today, he is perhaps better recognized for his influence on the latter discipline, particularly with respect to his analyses of topics such as magic, sacrifice and gift. Exchange in different cultures around the world. Morse had a significant influence upon Claude Levi Strauss the founder of structural anthropology. 2. His most famous work is The Gift, 1925. Background, Edit. Morse was born in Epinal, Vosges, to a Jewish family. His father a merchant and his mother an embroidery shop owner. Unlike his younger brother, Morse did not join the family business and instead he joined the Socialist and cooperative movement in the Vosges. Following the death of his grandfather, the Morse and Durkheim families grew close and at this time Morse began to feel concerned about his education and took initiatives in order to learn. Morse obtained a religious education and was bar mitzvahed, yet by the age of 18 he stopped practicing his religion. 3. Morse studied philosophy at Bordeaux, where his maternal uncle Emile Durkheim was teaching at the time. In the 1890s, Morse began his lifelong study of linguistics, Indology, Sanskrit, Hebrew. Explore our developer friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF and the history of religions and uncivilized peoples at the École Pratique des Hautes Etudes, for he passed the aggregation in 1893. He was also the first cousin of the much younger Claudette, Ni Raphael, Bloch, a marine biologist and mother of Maurice Bloch, who became a noted anthropologist. Instead of taking the usual route of teaching at a lycee following college, Morse moved to Paris and took up the study of comparative religion and Sanskrit. His first publication in 1896 marked the beginning of a prolific career that would produce several landmarks in sociological literature. Like many members of the Annie Sociologique group, Morse was attracted to socialism especially that espoused by Gingers. He was particularly engaged around the anti-Semitic political events of the Dreyfus Affair. Towards the end of the century, he helped edit such left-wing papers as Le Populaire, El Humanite and Le Mouvement Socialiste, the last in collaboration with Georges Sorel. In 1901, 
Morse began drawing more on ethnography, and his work began to develop. Characteristics now associated with formal anthropology Morse served in the French Army during World War I from 1914 to 1919 as an interpreter. 5. The military service was liberating from Morse's intense academics, as he stated, I'm doing wonderfully. I just wasn't made for the intellectual life and I am enjoying the life war is giving me. Fournier 2006, 175 While liberating, he also dealt with the devastation and violence of the war as Many of his friends and colleagues died in the war, and his uncle Durkheim died shortly before its End Morse began to write a book on politics that remained unfinished, but the early 1920s emphasized his energy for politics through criticism of the Bolsheviks' coercive resort to violence and their destruction of the market economy. 6. Like many other followers of Durkheim, Morse took refuge in administration. He secured Durkheim's legacy by founding institutions to carry out research, such as El Institut Franzis de Sociology, 1924, and El Institut de Ethnology in 1926. These institutions stimulated the development of fieldwork based anthropology by young academics. Among the students he influenced were George Devereux, Jeannie Quisinia, Alfred Metro, Marcel Griaul, Georges Dumézil, Denise Palm, Michel Lewis, Germain Dietelin, Louis Dumont, André Georges Hordry Court, Jacques Soustel, and Germain Tillian. 5. In 1901, Morse was appointed to the chair of the History of Religions of Non Civilized Peoples at the Ecole Pratique des Hautes Etudes. 7. 7. Two years later, in 1931, Morse was elected as the first holder of the chair of sociology in the Collège de France, and soon after he married his secretary. In 1934 who soon was bedridden after a poisonous gas incident. Later, in 1940, Morse was forced out of his job as the chair of sociology and out of Paris due to the German occupation and anti-Semitic legislation passed. Morse remained socially isolated following the war and died in 1950. 6. Explore our developer friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. Theoretical Views, Edit. Marcel Morse and Emile Durkheim. Marcel Morse's studies under his uncle Durkheim at Bordeaux led to their doing work together on. Primitive Classification which was published in the Annie Sociologique. In this work, Morse and Durkheim attempted to create a French version of the sociology of knowledge, illustrating the various paths of human thought taken by different cultures, in particular how space and time are connected back to societal patterns. They focused their study on tribal societies in order to achieve Depth. While Morse called himself a Durkheimian, he interpreted the school of Durkheim as his own. His early works reflect the dependence on Durkheim's school, yet as more works, including unpublished texts were read, Morse preferred to start many projects and often not finish them. Morse concerned himself more with politics than his uncle, as a member of the collectivists. French Workers' Party, and Revolutionary Socialist Workers' Party. His political involvement led up to and after World War I. 8. The Gift. Morse has been credited for his analytic framework which has been characterized as more supple, more appropriate for the application of empirical studies, and more fruitful than his earlier studies. With Durkheim. His work fell into two categories, 
one being major ethnological works on exchange. As a symbolic system, body techniques and the category of the person, and the second being social science methodology. 9. In his classic work The Gift, see external links for PDF, Morse. Argued that gifts are never truly free, rather, human history is full of examples of gifts bringing about reciprocal exchange. The famous question that drove his inquiry into the anthropology of the gift was, what power resides in the object given that causes its recipient to pay it back? 10. The answer is simple, the gift is a total prestation, see law of obligations, imbued with spiritual mechanisms, engaging the honor of both giver and receiver, the term total prestation or total. Social fact, fate social total, was coined by his student Maurice Leinhardt after Durkheim's social fact. Such transactions transcend the divisions between the spiritual and the material in a way that, according to Morse, is almost magical. The giver does not merely give an object but also part of himself, for the object is indissolubly tied to the giver the objects are never completely separated from the men who exchange them, 1990-31. Because of this bond between giver and gift, the act of giving creates a social bond with an obligation to reciprocate on the part of the recipient. Not to reciprocate means to lose honor and status, but the spiritual implications can be even worse, in Polynesia, failure to reciprocate means to lose mana, one's spiritual source of authority and wealth. To cite Goldmanida's summary, Morse distinguished between three obligations, giving, the necessary initial step for the creation and maintenance of social relationships, receiving, for to Explore our developer friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. Refuse to receive is to reject the social bond, and reciprocating in order to demonstrate one's own liberality, honor, and wealth. 2018 341. Morse describes how society is blinded by ideology, and Therefore a system of prestations survives in societies when regarding the economy. Institutions are founded on the unity of individuals and society, and capitalism rests on an unsustainable influence on an individual's wants. Rather than focusing on money, Morse describes the need to focus on fate's socio-totos, total social facts, which are legal economic, religious, and aesthetic facts, which challenge the sociological method. 6. An important notion in Morse's conceptualization of gift exchange is what Gregory, 1982-1997, refers to as inalienability. In a commodity economy, there is a strong distinction between objects and persons through the notion of private property. Objects are sold, meaning that the ownership rights are fully transferred to the new owner. The object has thereby become alienated from its original owner. In a gift economy, however, the objects that are given are unalienated from the givers, they are loaned rather than sold and ceded. It is the fact that the identity of the giver is invariably bound up with the object given that causes the gift to have a power which compels the recipient to reciprocate. Because gifts are unalienable they must be returned, the act of giving creates a gift debt that has to be repaid. Because of this, the notion of an expected return of the gift creates a relationship over time between two individuals. In other words, through gift-giving, a social bond evolves that is assumed to continue through space and time until the future moment of exchange.
gift exchange therefore leads to a mutual interdependence between giver and receiver. According to Morse, the free gift that is not returned is a contradiction because it cannot create social ties. Following the Durkheimian quest for understanding social cohesion through the concept of solidarity, Morse's argument is that solidarity is achieved through the social bonds created by gift. Exchange Morse emphasizes that exchanging gifts resulted from the will of attaching other people to put people under obligations, because in theory such gifts are voluntary, but in fact, they are given and repaid under obligation. 11. Morse and Hubert Morse also focused on the topic of sacrifice. The book Sacrifice and its Function which he wrote with Henry Hubert in 1899 argued that sacrifice is a process involving sacralizing and desacralizing. This was when the former directed the holy towards the person or object, and the latter away from a person or object. 12. Morse and Hubert proposed that the body is better understood not as a natural given. Instead, it should be seen as the product of specific training in attributes, deportments, and habits. Furthermore, the body techniques are biological, sociological, and psychological and in doing an analysis of the body, one must apprehend these elements simultaneously. They defined the person as a category of thought, the articulation of particular embodiment of law and morality. Morse and Hubert believed that a person was constituted by personages, a set of roles, which were executed through the behaviors and exercise of specific body techniques and attributes. Explore our developer-friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. Morse and Hubert wrote another book titled A General Theory of Magic in 1902, see external links. For PDF, they studied magic in primitive societies and how it has manifested into our thoughts and social actions. They argue that social facts are subjective and therefore should be considered magic, but society is not open to accepting this. In the book, Morse and Hubert state. In magic, we have offices, actions, and representations, we call a person who accomplishes magical actions a magician, even if he is not professional, magical. Representations are those ideas and beliefs which correspond to magical actions, as for these actions, with regard to which we have defined the other elements of magic, we shall call them magical rites. At this stage it is important to distinguish between these activities and other social practices with which they might be confused. 13. They go on to say that only social occurrences can be considered magical. Individual actions are not magic because if the whole community does not believe in efficacy of a group of actions, it is not social and therefore, cannot be magical. Legacy, Edit While Morse is known for several of his own works most notably his masterpiece S.I. Solo. Don, The Gift, much of his best work was done in collaboration with members of the Annie. Sociologique, including Durkheim, Primitive Classification, Henry Hubert, Outline of a General. Theory of Magic and Essay on the Nature and Function of Sacrifice, Paul Falconet, Sociology, and others. Morse influenced French anthropology and social science. He did not have a great number of students like many other sociologists did, however, he taught ethnographic method to first-generation French anthropology students. In addition to this, Morse's ideas have had a significant impact on Anglophile post-structuralist perspectives in anthropology, cultural studies, and cultural 
history. He modified post-structuralist and post-Falcaldian intellectuals because he combines an ethnographic approach with contextualization that is historical, sociological, and psychological. Moore served as an important link between the sociology of Durkheim and contemporary French sociologists. Some of these sociologists include Claude Levi Strauss, Pierre Bourdieu, Marcel Grainet, and Louis Dumont. The essay on the gift is the origin for anthropological studies of reciprocity. His analysis of the potlatch has inspired George's Batale, the accursed share, then. The Situationists, the name of the first Situationist journal was Potlatch. This term has been used by many interested in gift economies and open source software, although this latter use sometimes differs from Morse's original formulation. See also Lewis Hyde's revolutionary critique of Morse in Imagination and the Erotic Life of Property. He also impacted the movement anti-utilitarist Dons. Les Sciences Socials and David Graeber. 14. Explore our developer-friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. Critiques, Edit. Morse's views on the nature of gift exchange have had critics. Main critiques against Morse stem. From beliefs that Morse's essay is analyzing all primitive and archaic societies, but rather his essay is used to apply to one society and relationships within. 15. French anthropologist Alain Testart. 1998, for example, argues that there are free gifts, such as passers by giving money to beggars. For example in a large western city. Donor and receiver do not know each other and are unlikely ever to meet again. In this context, the donation certainly creates no obligation on the side of the beggar to reciprocate, neither the donor nor the beggar have such an expectation. Testart argues that only the latter can actually be enforced. He feels that Morse overstated the magnitude of the obligation created by social pressures, particularly in his description of the potlatch amongst North American Indians. Gift economy theorist Genevieve Vaughan, 1997, criticizes the French school of thought based on Morse, exemplified by Jack Scobout and Serge Latish and the movement anti-utilitaris. Des Sciences Socials, for defining gift giving as consisting of three moments, giving, receiving, and giving back. The insistence upon reciprocity hides the communicative character of simple giving and receiving without reciprocity and does not allow this group to make a clear distinction between gift giving and exchange as two opposing paradigms. 16. In subsequent works, for example, The Gift in the Heart of Language, The Maternal Source of Meaning, 2015. 17. Vaughan. Elaborated on gift giving as a relation between giver and receiver that takes its form from the primal human experience of mothering and being mothered. Another example of a non reciprocal free gift is provided by British anthropologist James Laidlaw. 2000. He describes the social context of Indian Jain renouncers, a group of itinerant celibate. Renouncers living an ascetic life of spiritual purification and salvation. The Jainist interpretation of the doctrine of Ahimsa, an extremely rigorous application of principles of nonviolence, influences the diet of Jain renouncers and compels them to avoid preparing food, as this could potentially involve violence against microscopic organisms. Since Jain renouncers do not work, they rely on food donations from lay families within the Jain community. However, the former must not appear to 
be having any wants or desires, and only very hesitantly and apologetically receives the food. Prepared by the latter. Free gifts therefore challenge the aspects of the motion notion of the gift. Unless the moral and non-material qualities of gifting are considered. These aspects are, of course, at the heart of the gift, as demonstrated in books such as Annette Wienus, 1992, Inalienable. Possessions, the paradox of keeping while giving. Morse's view on sacrifice was also controversial at the time. This was because it conflicted with the psychologization of individuals and social behavior. In addition to this, Morse's terms like persona and habitus have been used among some sociological approaches. French philosopher Georges Bataille used the gift to draw new conclusions based on economic anthropology, in this case, an Explore our developer-friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF Interpretation of how money is increasingly being wasted in society 15. They have also been Included in recent sociological and cultural studies by Pierre Bourdieu Bourdieu used Morse's Concept habitus through sociological concepts of socialization the embodiment of consciousness. An example being muscle memory. Selected works, edit. S.I. Sur la nature et la fonction du sacrifice, with Henry Hubert, 1898. La sociology, objet et méthode, with Paul Falconet, 1901. De Quelk's Forms Primitives de Classification, with Durkheim, 1902. Esquis d'un Theorie Générale de la Magie, with Henry Hubert, 1902. S.I. Sur le Don, 1925. Les Techniques du Corps, 1934. Marcel Morse, Les Techniques du Corps, 1934, Journal de Psychology 32, 3 4. Reprinted in Morse, Sociology et Anthropology, 1936, Paris, P.U.F. Sociology et Anthropology, Selected Writings, 1950. Manuel D. Ethnography, 1967. Editions Peo and Rivages. Manual of Ethnography 2009. Translated by N.J. Allen. Bergan Books. See also, Edit. Archaeology of Trade. Bronislaw Malinowski. De Beneficius. Killer Ring. Ernest Becker. Emile Durkheim. James George Fraser. References, Edit. One Carrot Hughes, Alex, Reader, Keith, E.D.S. 1998. Anthropology and Ethnology. Encyclopedia of Contemporary French Culture. London and New York, Routledge. P16. ISBN 978-1-134-78865-1. 2 Carit Moebius, Stefan, Nungessa, Frith Joff. 2014 La Filiationiste Directe l'Influence de Marcel Morse. Sir L. Oeuvre de Claude Levi Strauss. In, Eric Bryan, Stefan Moebius, Frith Joff Nungessa and Florence. Weber, eds. Relia Morse forward slash relection von Marcel Morse. Trivium. Review Franco Alemande de. Sciences Humanes et Socials. Deutsch Französisch Zeitschrift für Geists und Sozialwissenschaften. HTTP colon double forward slash trivium dot reviews dot org forward slash 4836. See also Bath, Frederick, 2005. One Discipline, Four Ways, British, German, French, and American Anthropology. University of Chicago Press. P208. 3 Carit Fornia, Marcel, 
1994. Marcel Morse, A Biography. France, Artheme Fayard. ISBN 0691117772. 4. Carrot Sicker, Alan. Social Thought, From Enlightenment to the Present. P306. 5. Carrot A.B. Scott, John. 50 Key Sociologists, The Formative Theorists. Explore our developer-friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. 6. Carat ABC Hart, Keith, 2007. Marcel Morse, In Pursuit of the Whole. Anthropology, Goldsmiths University. Of London. 7. Carat Cashmore, Ellis, Rejek. Dictionary of Cultural Theorists. Chris. 8. Carat Fournier, Marcel, 1994. Marcel Morse, A Biography. Italy, Artheme Fayard. 9. Carat Cashmore, Ellis, Rejek, Chris. Dictionary of Cultural Theorists. 10. Carat Morse, Marcel, 2002. The Gift, The Form and Reason for Exchanges in Archaic Societies. PDF. London, Routledge. P4. ISBN 978-0-203-71568-0. 11-D. Wolchak. 2015. The Process of Exchange, Solidarity and Sustainable Development in Building a Community of Responsibility. Mediterranean Journal of Social Sciences, 6, 1s1, p506. Archived. From the original on the 8th of February, 2015. 12 Carat Cashmore, Ellis, Rejek, Chris. Dictionary of Cultural Theorists. p350. 13 Carat Sika, Allen. Social Thought from the Enlightenment to the Present P308 14 Carat, Graeber, D. Toward an Anthropological Theory of Value, pp 16161, Palgrave Macmillan, 2001 15 Carat A. B. Panov, Michel, 1970 Marcel Morse's The Gift Revisited Man 5 16070. Do 10.2307 forward slash 2798804. ISSN 0025-1496. JSTA 2798804. 16 Carat Vaughan, Genevieve, 1997. Forgiving, a feminist criticism of exchange p. Austin, Texas, Plain. View Press, 1st Edition, Anomaly Press, 4th Printing, 2002. P54. ISBN 0-9110519495-5. Seventeen Carat Vaughan, Genevieve, 2015. The Gift in the Heart of Language, The Maternal Source of Meaning. UK, Mimeses International. ISBN 978-8869770128 Further reading, edit. Derrida, J. 1992-1991 Given time I counterfeit money. Chicago and London, University of Chicago Press. Cannell, Fenella, 2006, The Anthropology of Christianity, Introduction. Chris Gregory 1982. Gifts and Commodities. London. Goldman Ida, B. 2018. Hasidic Art and the Kabbalah. Leiden and Boston, Brill Press. Hasidic Art and the Kabbalah. https colon double forward slash en dot wikipedia dot org forward slash wiki forward slash chris underscore gregory chris gregory 
see a 1997. Savage Money, The Anthropology and Politics of Commodity Exchange. Amsterdam, Harvard Academic. Laidlaw, J. 2000. A Free Gift Makes No Friends Journal of the Royal Anthropological Institute 6 617634. Leacock, Seth, February, 1954. The Ethnological Theory of Marcel Morse. American Anthropologist. 56. 15873 do 10.1525 forward a.1954.56.1.0200060. ISSN 1548-1433. Morse, M1990-1922. The Gift. Forms and Functions of Exchange in Archaic Societies London, Routledge Morse, Marcel 2006 Techniques, Technology, and Civilization Edited and Introduced by Nathan Schlanger New York, Bergen Books ISBN 978-1-57181-662-0 Testart, a 1998. Uncertainties of the Obligation to Reciprocate, a Critique of Morse in Marcel Morse, a Centenary Tribute. James, W. and Allen, N.J. E.D.S. New York, Bergen Books. Wiener, Annette, 1992. Inalienable Possessions, The Paradox of Keeping While Giving. Barclay. University of California Press. ISBN 0-520-07604-4. Diane Tail, Ewan, ed. Marcel Morse à l'anthropologie de l'un et du multiple, Paris, PUF, Collection Debats. Philosophiques, 2013. Explore our developer-friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF. Zimra, Sylvain, Marcel Morse, Savantit Politik, La Découverte, 2007, Leary en Ligne La Préface de Marcel Fournier, Le Sommer et l'Intro. Fournier, Marcel. 1994. Marcel Morse. Fayard, Paris, The Definitive Biography in French. See Marcel. Morse, A Biography, Pup, 2005. Ferguson, Kennan. 2007. The Gift of Freedom. Social Text. 25 23952. Graeber, David Give It Away, An Essay. Levi Strauss. See 1987-1950. Introduction to the work of Marcel Morse. London, Routledge. Michon, Pascal 2015. Marcel Morse Retrouve. Origins de l'anthropologie du rythme. Paris, Rhythmos. Stephen Moebius Moebius, Stephen, forward slash Christian Papillude Papillude, Christian, ed. 2005. Gift Marcel. Morse Culture Theory de Gabe. Wiesbaden, V.S. Moebius, Stefan. 2006. Marcel Morse. Constance. External links, edit. Marcel Morse in the Encyclopedia Britannica. Marcel Morse at Anthrobase. A General Theory of Magic 1992 Translation Collection of French Writing Provided by the University of Quebec Categories 1872 Births 1950 Deaths 19th Century French Anthropologists 19th Century French Economists 19th Century French Essayists 19th century French male writers 19th century French philosophers
19th century French historians 20th century anthropologists 20th century French economists 20th century essayists 20th century French male writers 20th century French non-fiction writers 20th century French philosophers 20th century French historians anthropologists of religion continental philosophers Economic anthropologists French epistemologists French activists French anthropologists 19th century French Jews French male essayists French male non-fiction writers French section of the workers international politicians French socialists French sociologists Jewish activists Jewish anthropologists Jewish economists Jewish philosophers Jewish sociologists people from Epinal French philosophers of culture philosophers of economics French philosophers of history philosophers of religion philosophers of social Science French philosophers of technology sociologists of religion Theorists on Western civilization writers about activism and social change Writers about religion and science Explore our developer friendly HTML to PDF API printed using PDF Crowd HTML to PDF